Hi, I'm Beverly Knight and I'm here to see how projects supported by Christian Aid are bringing hope to some of Malawi's poorest communities. Of Malawi's population of 14 million, nearly 1 million are HIV positive. Lack of education and the stigma of HIV are two major problems. 50-year-old Dinah is HIV positive. She was heavily persecuted when first diagnosed with the virus. What kind of, of counselling and support have you received and, and where has that counselling and support come from? The work which I do with Diana, I do give her counseling, psychosocial counseling, and I do advise her how she can take her medication each and every day, and how she can have nice food in order to boost up high immune system. I met the most wonderful, erudite, charismatic man, um, Reverend Father MacDonald Sembereka, and he is a member of Manarella Plus, a Christian aid partner. It's a gathering of multi-faith uh, religious leaders who are coming together to fight the scourge of HIV in Malawi. Can you explain how the, the, the stigma has impacted on communities? For a long time, HIV was looked at as an epidemic for prostitutes or yes. sex workers or people who are, uh, you know, who are mischievous. There is a lot of stigma that has impeded uh, people, uh, people's ability to live positively yes. and even seek treatment. And uh, that has, uh, to me, stigma kills faster than the virus itself. The moment you live in a uh, very fearful situation which is perpetuated by stigma, then you run a, a, a situation of not being open about your epidemic. Yeah. So we realize that it's critical for us to address issues of stigma, uh, much as uh, we would also address the other aspects of the epidemic, including access to treatment. We're talking about a country that is trying to avert a crisis and Christian Aid and its partners are doing everything within their means to fight that. These are people who just want us to be facilitators through Christian Aid and its partners to enable them to help themselves, not just today, tomorrow, but for the long-term future.